gets shat on by KLO. So he jumps on so on KLO, he does his full combo, and then he's like, nuts. So he's like, got a bunch of tanky dudes. Should we make you get and get it? Okay. Ooh. Don't worry, they got the flash teleport. <laughs> Alright, double open these. Hey! Thank you. It's plastic. No! Security uh, sealed. Yep, security sealed. He uses security seal to unseal. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Too bad you didn't have Kagma! So you can't hear me very well? Nah, nah. Okay. And I just realized why the... Because I turned up my volume and didn't turn down leaks, why it was so fucking loud. I was like, my ears! <laughs> nah, I think it's also the fact that my ears are partially swollen, so I have hard of hearing already, and then it's just like, your, your volume's already... Yeah, my mic's so. up. Yeah. So, uh, I wasn't so impressed by today, like, watching Gambit play was pretty impressive, though. They, they were probably the two best games out of the all. Apparently, the first game of TSM, Wild Turtle Smash with yeah, Corky. Yeah, I watched that, he did. It's like, Corky! <laughs> got caught out several times, but then he just started cleaning up in fights. Yeah, and then the second game of TSM, they, they failed miserably. Yeah. It's just like... Fizz kept going in red, like, Wild Turtle, in late game, he started wrecking balls, like, he, he just started chasing people down, firing missiles, just like, sha, 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 and murdering them. That's the, that's the one thing I had about when versing a Corky, when, when, you're clear, when you're faster than him, and he's blowing his Valkyrie already, and he's trying to shoot missiles at you, and he, he can't get you, and then your teammate walks in the way trying to block it. And they kill you, with the big one, even though he was going to miss you. Teammates the worst. Nosy dewdrop. Evelyn, the straws, the straws are strong with this motherfucker. <laughs> oh, because um, Diamond Prox, yeah, played, yeah, he played uh, with the Kogma. I think that it, it's probably um. Dime, one of Diamond's most favorite characters, I think. Evelyn at the moment. Oh, did you see what? Um, yep. Really interesting thing Zelda put up was he was put up a really interesting idea, which I hope they go with because it sounds fucking amazing. Is to give a seventh item slot that can only be filled by a spe like one or three types of vision items. So you only can buy one vision item, you can sell it and buy another one if you want. The initial cost of the vision item is like 150 gold. So this could either be a, a, mi like a mini CV, like it's pathetically, like it's really cheap, it's on a 90 second cooldown, but it's like 30% of what normal CV is like, like the vision you get. So you can buy a mini CV, a mini ward, which is a 1 HP ward which can't stealth but this is the first upgrade of it so you can upgrade and it has an it's like a, a Regal's Landing where it's a 90 second cooldown last for 90 seconds and the other one was a mini like a mini stealth like the stealth reveal dust and um do Dota so you can activate it once every like all of these are like 90 second cooldown they're, no, like the first upgrade is really small. Like, it's supposed to be like a uh, really cheap, but it means like you can be like buy. You can buy a level one CV, and let's say you think they're in that. Like, you know the 
I think you'll be able to reveal one of the small brushes, like, you know, a red buff or whatever. So you can use your 90 second cooldown CV to scan that area and see if they're there. I think that's pretty cool. It's for ward alternatives and such. And they were thinking of it having like upgraded, so you could upgrade it so it costs like 700 gold to upgrade it, but or you're, you're not really getting an upgrade to an item, so it won't give you like really good stats, it just upgrades the fact of like the, the mini ward made when you upgrade it will stealth or whatever so it becomes an actual ward the and they was talking about like the the stealth scanner will become activate for like five seconds and be oh it'll be no it'll be no uh, it'll be more like a become like a mini oracles which you activate and has a timer sort of thing like 30 seconds but you can run around with it i thought that was cool what do you think of that? Sorry, I'm with a vein who fucking has no idea how to trade my game. Ah, that's gonna suck. <laughs> oh, you got the flash narcissus to watch out for though. Yeah, no. Ah, uh, flash probably be better against your team thinking about it though. Like, ghosts. You, have, you guys have so many slows that ghost is gonna like shit itself. Uh, is that first blood already? Okay. I saw you move your biscuit to your other slot, you bastard. I recommend skipping. At least Bane took cleanse against the fucking um Yeah, like I said, I would have actually put Lissandra against. Yeah, well, I'm in solo queue yeah. where everyone's fucking retarded. I know, I know. I'm not blaming you. I didn't say you did this. Boxy managed to blow um, Narcissus' flash. Which you can't. Mm. Oh wow, this Kale's such a dick. So Boxy goes to counter jungle the raves, Kale runs up to last hit the big rave. Even though her minions are already dying, that sort of stuff. It's just like, why? I 
I think you solely saved Rain's life by polymorphing Jana. When she. Wow. This Chaos deserves to fucking die. It's too fucking greedy. That was a nice pickup by Boxy though, catching out the. Then she tries to duel Zed. He's like, "Why are you doing that, bro?" Whoa. And they thought that a level five Shivana was taking the Dragon. Just like, how the fuck do you think a level 5 Shivan is taking Dragon? I recommend Oh, this box is so bad. But by doing that, they force the spine out of... Um... Narcissus, though. Yep. 
Tasted purple. with your eyes closed. Now your team has off. destroyed a turret. Ah. Why do they get a really good team that works together? Fucking hell. Yeah, I'm like looking at like all the teamwork they're fucking doing. And I'm just like, what the hell? Like, um, Jana pings that Javana might be going to take their blue buff. Zed comes over and check, like puts a ward down. It's like that wouldn't happen. Fucking hell. Also, the note that the kale is bad as well. Just like.
chance. There's probably only one good thing about this is that Zed sucks at farming underneath tower. Like, how the fuck do you fail at farming underneath tower? Warning you like a motherfucker. Yep, that tasted purple. I recommend skipping. There's one good thing about that was that you got two towers down pretty quick and your towers were pretty healthy. Yeah. So it means you guys are actually taking objectives and they seem to be just fumbling around and <laughs> And that's still so bullshit out. Caitlyn can easily outrange the tower to harass you. These people are so greedy. You'll see more with your eyes so, Singe just flashed and sprinted underneath two towers to chase Boxy, who dragon formed, burned out, got Kale altered, and he blew his flash and died. Uh, Boxy did have to use exhaust on him, but that's a lower cooldown on than flash. So it seems like the Zed's actually quite bad. It just only shows how bullshit Zed can be. Like, yeah, but uh, uh, yeah, because of the Kale, Lissandra, they're just gonna shut them both down, and then Vayne goes to town on. Since since becomes. Practically worthless because he's just rooted by Lissandra, knocked away, he polymorphed. He's gonna have a bad time. Like, I think Boxy will do even more than that, and she's playing Shivana, who doesn't do the best in late game. Yeah. As well as the fact that even if Zed did get a good ult and so on, Kale ult. Pretty much makes his burst useless. And I just realized um, 
the Lily Shivana combo. Get buried! Oh, Caitlyn rushed the Infinity Edge. What happened? No, okay. It's Reggie! <laughs> it's, <Reggie. laughs> it's Reggie Noodles all along. Wow. This sin shoots. Oh. Yeah. Ugh. Stupid kale. I think it's. I think Boxy was a, a really big thing about why. Because she was stopping all the tower bushes and pushing out all the lanes when people were that. She did a lot. I mean, so like. Boxy probably kept um, top tower. Yeah, she definitely kept top tower and possibly mid tower alive for quite a long time, just because of her movements. Because there was a point when both Singed and um, Narcissus were trying to push down top tower. They had a huge minion wave, Boxy just cleared it all out and they were trying to harass her. It's like, you can't really do that when you're both people that do no damage and there's a tower. And we can clearly see your 2k above the jhana. 2k gold above the jhana. This basically shows how the game is going, I think. Oh, this series does not know where to put his goo at all. He just threw it out randomly, just like he's in. Okay. I just saw um, the Zed Narcissus Singe combo of doing no damage. <laughs> Kale nullified all the Zed's damage. He's like, what a. So he's used up his entire combo. He's useless now. And Singe and Narcissus are both like, we do no damage. Hey guys, we do no damage. <laughs> Caitlyn's probably the only good person on that team. Yeah, like and it's Caitlyn. Uh, what about Jana? She seems to be. Uh, okay. Oh, nah. It's because she was doing so. Like, there's so many pings coming out from the Jana. And she's doing such good ward placement. That's why I thought maybe she hasn't played Jana. Oh, well, she's that's lucky sucks. because her team fucking sucks. Mine yeah. does too, but my team has overpowered things like me. Yeah. Oh, but Boxy's all glitched out and such, has infinite burnout. <laughs> oh, 
Did they first pick Z or something? No, oh, okay. I mean, did they pick Z really early, did they? That's Trinity is probably one of the best single items for. Yeah, but I mean like Trinity is probably like, if you're only gonna go one offensive item on Shivana, Trinity is probably the best. Just saying, because it does so much for her. Yeah, I just realized she only still has boots one. Just like, oh. oh. <laughs> she was running on boots one the whole time. The whole time! And she doesn't even have any movement. Uh, any movement quints or anything like that. And she's been roaming so much. Jeez. I think Boxy does a lot better on Shivana than Lee Sin, just saying. Whenever I see him play Lee Sin, he always like does something stupid because of Lee Sin mechanics, and then he can get killed. I think Shivana's a much better jungler for his playstyle of being aggressive. I mean, Boxy's just got double kill. <laughs> oh, he's got a page. I was just like, <clears throat> yep. that tasted purple. Uh, I just realized Boxy's the tankiest person in the game and is uh, building damage now. Uh, I would have got Mo I would have got Moby's ages ago. I don't think Moby's is worth it now. I would have got like um, movement speed, no swiftness, because they have a lot of slows that that fuck go for Shimana. I would have got a Moby boots much earlier in the game if I was going to get Moby. Just saying. Apparently, it's Riot's fault that not. This is Riot's fault. Nope. How is it Riot's fault? Like, what did Riot do? Nas is one of the most overpowered champions at the moment. This is Riot's fault! Singe building, building stupid. Like, Singe's build, yeah, I would've got the Rod of Ages. Then I would have got like some sort of awesome defensive item to go with it. Not. Zed can't even hundreds of years. Yeah. Oh, look at Z look at Zed's build. He hasn't even he went cutless. Hex drinker brutalizer. He has no completed items. I would have at least completed the fucking um uh that item I hate now. Uh, that's Bork, because that that improves your kill potential so much if you do it right. People they probably just went like, "Oh, Zed overpowered." He's talking me. Yeah, good on that. Uh -huh. But they probably went like, "Zed overpowered." That sort of shit, and you're like, "Huh." And they'll probably be like, I'm just going to sit up top lane as Singe forever. He hasn't been up top lane. Like, the amount of time... I'm sure Singe, if he just stayed top lane and only teleported in, he could have already taken, like, a second tier tower. But he's been roaming stupidly and feeding. When it's like, no. No, kill yourself. 
And no one on their team has bought Merc Treads. It's like Lissandra. It's like. I know you have a lot of slows, but I think the Lissandra stun is and snare is worth something to buy Merc Treads. Especially since it's a, it's a dual AP carry. You're going to a AP. It's a good idea to buy Merc Treads or some sort of magic business item. But they're like, no, no. Yeah, you're really good at support when you, besides when you play Alistair. I, I'm still mad, you can tell. You murdered me! What? <laughs> All that effort and you murdered me. <laughs> okay. Oh. You'll see more with your eyes closed. You were trying the whole time. No, <laughs> And it's tr spam trying to surrender as well. It's three to one. Oh, that uh, Kaolot actually saved you, even though it didn't look like it did. It stopped a headshot. One headshot probably killed you easily. Not oh, Zed finally finished his ball. At like 32 minutes, just like <laughs> way too late. Yay!